morning from the mountains as you can see we had a good night's sleep but it was uh, a little bit <laughs> short because uh, there were people coming in a little bit later and there was some music which was fine but it's just yeah it was a bit hard to get to sleep and Otto uh, I think I don't know he his stomach was a little bit upset so he uh, had to go outside twice at night but still it was really nice waking up seeing the sunrise over the mountains have a coffee and breakfast and yeah really just this feeling of peace and quiet that you get in the mountains it's uh, incredible and so yeah it's really good for your mind your soul and i've really enjoyed that we're now in an area as you can see it's really rocky we're not entirely sure if to do some reading on that whether that's a granite rock or limestone could be both when it comes to the color but as you can see it's really rocky and there's almost no vegetation no um, lakes nothing uh, which is why this area is called uh, Steinernes Meer which roughly translates to stony sea or sea of stones sea of rocks and you can really see like the rocks form this yeah almost like a, a wave shape it's really interesting it's so rough and the stones are really sharp they have really sharp edges but at the same time it's so beautiful it's it's really yeah it's rough and there's nothing but still it holds such a special beauty hard to describe so we're walking through this area this morning basically we're going back down it's another maybe 10 11 miles maybe a bit more and our end point today is the Königssee which is probably one of the most famous lakes or mountain lakes at least in Germany because we are crossing the border to Germany yeah it's a very beautiful area um, as well the Königssee is really it's a really deep lake and it has crystal clear water I'm going to show you later and that's our end point for today we're going to have a swim there I think it's going to be another great day it's very sunny but probably not as hard as yesterday because we're going mostly downhill today and yeah really excited so let's go We've reached our halfway point for today, another mountain hut, and we're going to have a coffee and some water.
look at that, this is one of the highlight sections today. It's called the Saugasse. <laughs> and as you can see, it's really steep. It goes in like uh, U-shapes down there. And I think over this little bit here, we're going to lose 400 meters of elevation. So yeah, the path itself, it's not really steep, but in total, since we're going really steep down, it looks really cool. There it is, our first glimpse of the Königssee. I think we still have to lose 200 meters to get down to the shore, but yay, getting closer. This is the Königssee, probably one of the most famous or the most famous mountain lake in Germany. Look at those mountains that are around the lake, it's so stunning. As you can see, you can't access the shore, so you can't walk um, to the end of the lake, you, only, um, you can only go there. There's a town there and you can only go there by boat. That's what we're going to do later. This is it! We've made it! We've made it to the shore and almost to our end point for today. We're going for a little swim in the lake and then we're taking the boat back to our car and uh, yeah, going to my sister's place. I'm going to stay there for another day and we'll do some day hiking tomorrow. It's been really nice, but also very warm again, so I'm really happy to have a little swim our end point for today. This is uh, St. Bartolome, which is a church and used to be a uh, pilgrimage site. And um, that's where we are going to take the boat. There are a couple of people waiting. I think we're going to get an ice cream while we're waiting and then we're going back to the car. Mm -hmm. 